Depuis quelques années, le ciel se couvre de nuages noirs pour ceux qui, dans le monde occidental, font le choix d'exercer la médecine autrement. Les homéopathes en particulier. Les attaques d'une violence peu commune visent à exclure l'homéopathie du champ de la médecine. Ému par tant d'ignorance et d'intolérance à l'égard de l'homéopathie, j'ai le désir d'en faire connaître la réalité subtile à travers le témoignage de tous ceux qui, dans ce film, l'ont rencontré sur leur chemin de vie. Hello and welcome to a very, very special uh, session today. Um, it's the premiere of a, a movie, a movie on homeopathy, one of its kind, by my very dear friend, Dr. William. How are you, William? I'm fine. <laughs> and you, go <laughs> I'm very good. I'm so excited uh, about the movie and about it being launched on our YouTube channel that um, I wanted to ask you and invite you and uh, talk to you about the movie and, and the whole uh, spirit of making this movie. Tell me something about how did the idea about the movie first incepted in your mind? The first idea was the origin was an outrage and anger because uh, I began to feel this six years ago at the denigration of homeopathy that was beginning to be organized in Western countries, especially in Europe. The attacks on homeopathy are not new, you know. It comes from, it, it begins, uh, the attacks are two centuries old. From the start, its founder, Samuel Hahnemann, has faced major criticism as member of the Academy of Science. Every, we know that he was a genius, a chemist, master of botany, pharmacy, and medicine, as well as a great translator, a great scientific. Also, I was not convinced by the film, by the other film. I saw all the films on homeopathy, and I never saw a film uh, who was showing what was really homeopathy in all its complexity. <clears throat> Because a lot of people talk about homeopathy, but they don't know exactly what it is. It's medicine with an extreme precise doctrine, and I wanted to show what was the doctrine. I wanted to show also the scientific aspects that you never see in, in the other movies. Generally, in the film, in the other films, in television, in French television, you see um, some caricatures of homeopaths. You show, you see patients who are better, who are improved with homeopathy, but you don't know exactly how, you don't know exactly what is the complexity of the approach And I wanted to show all the aspects of homeopathy to share what is the experience of patients and what is the experience of the prac practitioner. And also I want to show the universality of homeopathy because homeopathy for me is an ecologic medicine before every medicine because you don't take anything in the environment and you don't reject anything and so we need this medicine actually because we saw for example the disaster for with antibiotics anti antibiotics rejects we saw also for example for phytotherapy we saw how the the films actually they they, they are um, they want to take every plant and everything and it, it, it's a problem for ecology and so homeopathy is a wonderful medicine because you can first adapt to each situation you don't have any problems of reject or taking in the nature you have effects very deep and long and without side effects. 
And so for me, I wanted to share everything and also show how it's possible to, to cure homeopathy, animals with vets, veterinarians experience. And also now it's more confidential, but also in agriculture, agro homeopathy is growing up. And so we see that that medicine is one of the solution of the problem of ecology that we have in front of us. Interesting, so interesting. So because I, I remember when I came to Geneva two, three years back and you were so excited to show me the part of the movie. How many years did it actually take for you to make the movie? Tell us a little bit about the struggles that you went through to make this movie. It, it was very difficult because I did not have any money. And so I had to, to, to create an association for asking money with the crowdfunding and in France and in Switzerland and uh, in Belgium, uh, a lot of friends helped me and gave me money, gave the, to the association money to make the film. And it was a long time for this. And uh, after <clears throat> I had problems with the choice of the um, movie makers, I changed two times, three times of team. And it was very difficult to find movie makers that understand what I wanted to show and who can um, uh, have a confidence in my project because I did not know anything on, on, the, on the film and cinema. I dreamed all my life of making film. I, I love cinema and I think cinema can change a film, movie, they can change the life and some some movie changed my life so i wanted to to change the sight of people on homeopathy and it was four years of working with my with my clinic also uh, it was during my holidays and and i i made all the 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 works a uh, producer um uh, regisseur uh, I was in the realization because my, my movie makers they do, did not know anything about homeopathy. I chose the Ooh. people for the film. I make the, the um, uh, I had to, to organize the, the meetings uh, and also after for the um, uh, organization of the film and everything. And I wrote the film in four years. I worked uh, very hard for for this result, and now I'm very, I'm very happy to to share this with the, with uh, everybody. Thank you, thank, thank you, you, thank so, you much so much. For you. It's, a it's a magnanimous, magnanimous thing. thing. What I want to ask you, ask you, and my final question is, what is your message to all the viewers, all the homeopathic students, the homeopaths, the patients, the the critics of homeopathy who are going to be watching this movie? What is your real message that you want to give? My message is that before criticizing, criticizing homeopathy, you have to really understand the, the base of this medicine. You can say anything if you don't read the organon of Hahnemann and if you don't read the Materia Medica, and if you can't compare what is in the provings in the Materia Medica and the clinical reality of patients. All the students are often very surprised of seeing this beauty of the, the, the relationship between what is written in the Materia Medica and what we see in the clinic with the patients and the efficiency of this. It's the problem with homeopathy is the proof. And we understand easily that 
it's difficult to prove scientifically the, the homeopathic effects uh, because <coughs> it's an individualization uh, process. But we have a lot of proof, not a lot of proof, excuse me. We have enough proof that there is a biologic effect, physical effects on cells, on animals, on plants. We have also randomized trials that show an efficiency on some diseases. And we know also that a lot of people, enemies of homeopathy exist and they make all all the uh, they can to discredit homeopathy and so we we know this it's like the climate climatoseptic and skeptics are for a lot of things they are so it's normal because homeopathy is really efficient in on the um, with the patients the patients say this 300 millions of people use homeopathy in the world. It, it's not, it's make no sense that it's placebo. And we are, I am allopath doctor and I am homeopath and I can choose the, the one medicine or another. And I see differences in 30 years of practice of psychiatry. So for me, there is no doubt that we have efficiency clinical but in the in the consultation and all the homeopaths of all over the world they say the same things all the vets all the agriculture that do homeopathy all the mother of family all the practitioners independent of the culture they say the same thing it works so we have to study more and more this medicine and we have to uh, um, to make better the, the practice and also continue to make randomized trials. But we can show 20, 30, 100 trials. There's enemies says, no, it's not possible. So it's reason why I wanted to show also scientific aspects and you don't see this in the other films. We have pictures and photographies now of what is, what are different dilution of gelsemium and cuprum and other things. We can see the difference with only water pure and water with the dilution of homeopathy. So I think we have enough proof that there is something with homeopathy. Another thing it I want to I wanted to say, and the film finished on this question that medicine, conventional medicine, is really in uh, in difficulties or, or failure in chronic diseases, and so we have to to be together and I am a defender of integrative medicine because it's not to do everything in same times, but we have to choose for each patient if homeopathy or another technique is better for him. What is the better for the, for the patient and what is the choice of the patient? We have to respect this. And so for me, uh, homeopathy, we have also failures and we have to be, we, 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 we need humility. We have very, very incredible results, but we have also a lot of fail. And so it's not easy. And sometimes allopathy is good. And for me, allopathy and conventional medicine, I can use in psychiatric disease and it's not a problem for me. I prefer, and I saw in 13 years of practice that homeopathy cure really 
deeply the patients and long, long time. So I'm sure that it is very interesting, but sometimes I'm, 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 I, I fail. So I, I know that I can use another approach. And I am defender of an open, open approach in the interest of the patients. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, William. And um, I think this movie will inspire a lot of uh, homeopaths and a lot of students and a lot of uh, passionate followers of homeopathy. Thank you so much for making this. And I'm going to put up your email ID in the end of our talk so that people can write to you their feedback about the movie. And you're going to get a lot of emails, uh, hopefully. Thank you so much, William. Namaste from India. Namaste. Go on. And thank you for all what you do for homeopathy too. Thank you, William. Thank you so much.